Go! Greetings, co-processors. Ian here with Verbal Processing, and I am back with a little game, well, a mini game called Mini Craft. This is a browser-based game. I shall put link in the description. It was made by Notch for, and I'm going to butcher this, Ludum Dare or Ludum Dare. I would love if somebody gave me the proper phonetic pronunciation of that term. And it is ostensibly a 2D top-down Minecrafty like game, but uh, there are some significant differences. The kinds of things you build and your over the, the fact that there is an overall objective to defeat the air wizard, well, there's just different stuff going on here with a with a familiar coating, shall we say. Back off, zombie. I could actually go for some slime gels. I wouldn't mind making that lantern, which I believe I'm gonna need for the caves, and that might be what makes me unqualified for the caves. I was noting in the last episode that some people had told me that I was under geared for the caves and I didn't really understand why that would be. Okay, this is freaking me out. I want that slime gel. Let's get that. Oh, I'm not gonna get it in time. Oh, that annoys me. Oh well. All right, yeah, they said I was under geared for the cave level and I didn't understand why, but I, then I noticed when I went down there I had a very limited light radius and so that may, wear, way, may very well be the reason. I'm trying to stick relatively close to my home base here because, ooh, there's another cave there, excellent. And there's also a, a weird sort of cave going up to some other realm. I have a feeling I've gotten a very lucky spawn with my world here because I suspect that if I go into the cave up there and I work my way down to that spot, then I shall be able to descend to another biome, possibly some sort of sky realm is what I, uh, what I expect to find up there. So let's see here. Go back to the rock axe. I'm just gearing up a little bit here. Boom. Boom. I said boom, chick boom. I'd actually like to have enough to make a chest and put some of my other items away in it. And I, uh, there's several items and, and ty you know, types, of, types of materials I don't know where to get yet. So I've got to sort of figure that out too. I think I probably need to go to the beach or somewhere near water and see if if I see if I can get sand for glass there. So, let's see what else can we build here. Let's go ahead and build that chest right now. And select that. Bam. Bam. Okay. Aha. Okay, let's get rid of Let's see, that's wood. Wood wood for now. I can always come back and get them later, I suppose if necessary. I need to get more slimes and just a bunch of other stuff that I am not sure when or where I shall need. <clears throat> but the lantern, we're gonna need what appears to be glass. Let me go down here and look. I think I need to look at the furnace inventory, actually. We I eventually wanna make this anvil, but I've never seen any of those bars or, or any any ore of any kind. I'm gonna need a little bit more wood and a few more slime gels. That's Those ones are fairly easy to deal with. It's the sand I have not too much of a clue about at this point. This is the furnace for bread, or excuse me, the oven for bread, and then yes, that is glass, gold, and iron. All right, so we've gotta be on the lookout for those things. I'm trying to decide, do I wanna go? Oh, I guess I'm gonna go due east. I'm just gonna do my best to try to stay directly east rather than going off on some kind of tangent. Oh, I have not crafted a few things that I should like to bring along. Uh, okay, you gonna come over here, buddy? Let's go ahead and deal with you. Uh-oh. There we are. A few other things that I should like to bring along at this point. Oops. Oh, man. Seems many keys do stuff. <laughs> uh, there we are. I needed, I need a rock. Wouldn't hurt to bring a rock hoe, although it's, I don't think that's strictly necessary. I think I need to bring the rock shovel. I'm pretty sure I do not currently have a rock shovel. Yeah, that is the case. So let us equip the rock axe and take care of these axe holes. Aha! Fortunately, those seem to craft up or be fairly quickly acquired. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Rock shovel, there we go. And I also might just try digging a little bit here in the main ground and see what happens. Rock axe. Okay, whoops, I made two of them. That was silly of me. All right. Rock shovel, of course, is what I meant and hopefully what I actually made. Rock shovel, rock shovel. Rock sword, yes, 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 yes. All right, this is all stuff we want. Rock pick. Rock shovel. 
Okay, is I, that's either dirt or sand, I presume. Although likely to be dirt. Ooh, there's some seeds. Let's take a look here. Well, let's just take a look at our inventory and see what it's called. Man, C, okay, C and spacebar do the same thing. That's interesting. All right. So, that is, I have some coal, I have some dirt here. And what happens if I pick the dirt, I wonder? Ah, I can fill those back in. How very pleasant. And I'm not sure what else I might be able to do with the dirt. I'm assuming... Let's see, glass requires something that looks like sand and, and some coal. All right, yeah, so, so likely sand. We're gonna have to go find some sand. Let's see, where's the rock? Where's my rock sword? The sword of rock. The sword of rock is on the move. All right, so we're gonna try to go due east here. Dear, 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 dear. Hopefully this isn't too bad for zombie killing. No, it's decent. Okay, good. Quite close to some water, which I'm hoping there will be the we will find something that resembles sand over here somewhere. I'm not sure exactly how that's supposed to work. So being in the water sap, seems to sap your energy away. And you can indeed, let's see here. Rock shovel, you can dig a trench for the water to drain into when it will eventually fill it up. Now I'm assuming that's still all, that's, that's just all dirt. I have I see I see no evidence to the contrary. I see nothing labeled sand here, and sand seemed to have a more yellow color. So, um, I guess what I what I'm concerned about is not figuring out where how to get back to the homestead. So, I'm gonna put like a sort of a sort of an inlet on the coast here that points back to my home. That way, I can follow the coast to get back, and then this will point me directly back to the old homestead when I get back up this way. So, doing my best, in fact, I should probably just stay directly on the coast for, just to be sure that I'm not gonna get myself into any trouble. Rock X, rock X. Rock X, rock X, choppity chop. These trees are going down like the, and then go plop. <laughs> All right, oh, why did it have to get so dense up here? Mm, but at least I got some apples. Apples to eat. Apples, apples everywhere. I'm gonna think I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna be very sad that I can't save that I know of in this game. Because <laughs> there's kind of a lot going on here. This is, the exploration component, I feel like, you know, I've, I've barely scratched the surface, although I don't know if I can expect any other biomes or anything of that nature in here. There's just another zombie hiding out in some trees. Pleased to be backing the hell off, sir. Actually, I should probably try to collect the cloth up because I'm not sure what I will need or how much of it I shall need. So, better to be safe and just collect everything that I can since there doesn't seem to be any limitation to the size of the inventory. And we need to eat some more apples. Let's not risk Let's not risk an unfriendly encounter with a terrifying beast. Oops, didn't mean to use that. All right, rock axe. Well, thank, thankfully, no durability on the weapons. You, ooh, thank you, I wanted that. Wanted that very much. Sand, ooh, hey, now, come on. So I wasn't trying to make out with you, I was, I didn't even want to have to kill you, buddy. You forced my hand. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, I thought that was gonna be a single hit. All right, we're burning through these apples here. Burn, baby, burn. Uh, eat, eat, eat more food. Mm -hmm. Rock shovel. Okay, now we can harvest us some sand. Oh, there's a cactus. I'm assuming we don't want to run directly into that, although wouldn't mind harvesting the cactus itself, if that is possible. Not sure how much of this I'm gonna need. But in any case, we're gonna have to wait until next time to find out what to do with all this sand, how much of it there is, and what the heck is going on with that cactus. So until next time, this has been Ian with Verbal Processing. I'm getting munched by zombies, and I will see you soon.